How oh, do? Time for another beer review. For this one, we're going to one of the new beers in Tesco. It's from Not of a Monk. It's a collab with SKGN, who is the artist that's done the work on this can. And it's Faith in Futures. Now, before you go, hang on a minute, Greg, you've already reviewed this. Um, there, this is the second Faith in Futures that's gone into Tesco. The first one was a 6.5% one. It's on my channel. It's in the Tesco playlist. It was beautiful. It's one of the best beers that's been in the supermarket um, for a long time. Big mango flavours. Fantastic. So uh, this one is um, with Azaka, Citra and Sabro. So we'll see what we get with this. Hopefully, if it's anywhere near as good as that one, then we're on to a winner. Um, I've heard a lot of good things about the new Tesco um, super big tangerine aroma there as I was opening the can. Um, I've heard a lot of good things about the new Tesco range. I haven't watched a lot of videos yet. I plan to watch them when I've um, done my own reviews on them. So um, I'm going to mix it up. I'm, gonna, I'm not rushing out to just get them up. I, I've got loads of beer in the fridge, so I'm going to mix it up. I'll, I'll do a few Tesco ones and a, a few other ones just to try to keep my own interests in it more than anything. So look at that. That is a beautiful looking beer. Um, orange. Looks really, really thick. It's got quite a foamy white head on that. Lots of spacious bubbles in it. So get the nose. Yeah, lots of tangerines coming out in abundance. Yeah, maybe a hint of pineapple, but it's really predominantly tangerine. So let's dive in. Cheers, everybody. brilliant that is really really good um up there with the other faith and futures really really encouraged that is fantastic lots of big bold punchy flavors lots of tangerine in there bit of coconut on the finish so slightly dry so that's the sabro hop jumping out at you there um yeah a little bit of pineapple in there as well but it screams tangerines in abundance. It it's fantastic. Um, on a like, on a par with the first faith and futures for me. Got a lovely body on it. You know, for what is it? Three three pound three pound fifty for a for a supermarket beer. It's really really good. I've been like I say, I've been tired with a lot of supermarket beers of late, and and I totally get it. You know, people get bored of seeing the same stuff. They want to try new things. And I don't know if it's just with the cost of living crisis that's going on at the minute, but so far this year, I've been a little bit underwhelmed with the supermarket beers. And I think it's came across in a few of my reviews, but this is really, really encouraging. This is a fantastic beer. Um, I would happily revisit this again. And I've got, like I say, I've got a few more from Tesco to try. So if they're on a par with this, we're on to a winner. That's great. Lots of tangerine and coconut. It works a treat. I love it. Um, but I love the Sabro Hub. So yeah, I'm going to recommend that one. That's a no-brainer. That's Faith in Futures. I'll add that to my Tesco playlist and I'll stick it in my Rob Monk playlist. Thank you for watching and until the next one. Cheers.